Hi guys, it's Felicia again. I'm gonna come to you with the other part that I was saying I had another video of the fabric I got from Cynthia at African Clothing Store. Um, this one's gonna be quicker than the other one, the other video, cause I don't have the names and I'm not looking that one up. So I won't take too long. So. And I'm not for sure what I paid for, cause this was like a couple months ago. I just got it stuck in a tote over here. But they're too beautiful not to pass up. When I saw them again, when I was looking down, I was like, oh my gosh, they're so pretty. Look at that, that is just so cute. This one's a six yard bundle. My second favorite color is brown. Honestly, I can really see a lot of these with uh, my favorite. I truly hate, 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 hate these loud motorcycles and loud cars. Gosh, they kill me. I can see a lot of them with Mean G's uh, wide lead pattern. Um, I know it doesn't call for, it says cotton blends, but I, I am going to try a pair of, uh, a pair, one of my fabrics. I mean, why not? Why not try them? I bought it, I might as well try it, right? Because I got such pretty ones. Look at that. Beautiful. And my husband's always asked, what are you gonna do with all this fabric? You can't use it. <laughs> anyway, beautiful, right? Beautiful, beautiful. Look at this one. Again, you know my favorite color is purple, so the majority of the fabric I buy is purple. I have purple shoes. Which I need some purple casual shoes. Let me have to see if I can find some real quick. Because I think that would be cute. Like how she's got, no, she's got my color on, right? Purple. And then she has a purple sandal. I don't want sandals because it's, uh, you know, falls here. So I want something my toes covered up. But I'm going to see if I can find some purple. That's pretty too. Most of them, you know, are so vibrant that they'll definitely be summer for summer. They're just too pretty. Too pretty! And this one has a slew of colors in it. This one I got uh, Black History Month Juneteenth vibes out of that. Yeah. Now this one could pass as a fall one. Hmm. Get that out to try it. Those pants and so I'm going to a trip in North Carolina frock tails in Raleigh, Raleigh, North Carolina with my girlfriend Cheryl. Shout out to Cheryl for going with me. Um, just trying to find something because they have something to just participate on Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Saturday's outfit is on the desk. Which Saturday is the main, main thing. I'm going with this girl right here. And, and this is an Ankara from Cynthia. 
it is the theme is um stars galaxy and stars or something like that so this Ankara has stars on it so that's going to be my main outfit which is ready to sew up I just gotta sit down and do it I leave next Thursday on my flight and it's still there but Friday I have something for Friday I think I'm gonna wear this. This fabric I got in Egypt when we went uh, a couple of years ago. Love it. It is oh, I already put it up. That outfit, and I'm gonna do a video over that. My mates sometime. Um, I made a dress to wear to church out there. It was goodness, this simple dress made out of this stretch fabric from Joann's. It turned out really pretty, really pretty. Cotton flying around. Uh, anywho, just a few more to show. This gray, like woodsy, that would be cute for fall. Fall pants. Yeah. See, that's my problem. I was watching a video this morning from um, oh my gosh, Chris, uh, so so social, the one that lives in the islands, Jamaica, Bahamas, somewhere. I'm forgot, sorry, but she was saying how either your mojo is just gone, or you're on the other end where you you sewing and your fabric is all in your head. You got so much stuff going on. You, you know, you do it. I done sewed probably a thousand patterns this week in my head, and I've only completed three because it's just so much. And then living in this little 700 square apartment, I get so overwhelmed because I have so much stuff in here that it's just really ridiculous. That, uh, yeah, anywho, I'm babbling. Let me finish up. Uh, this is another cute print. About, this one is very thin, it's really, really thin. But we're gonna make it do what it do. It's gonna be a top, I think. It's too thin for bottoms. Here's another colorful. Isn't that pretty? Woo, that's pretty. And I'm not really a blue girl, but that was calling my name. I don't know. Yeah, there's no purple in it at all. It was probably another $15 one for three, three uh, yards. Last but not least, no, no, not last but not least. There's another colorful one. I'm so glad I didn't do any duplicates. I thought I was gonna do duplicates because I never look at my stuff. And these all had to be all scanned in on my phone because they're not. But this is the last one. I started making some culottes and I haven't finished it. But isn't it pretty? I mean, the culottes are pretty much done. I just gotta do the waistband, put the zipper in and the waistband. And these have been done since I got that fabric, but I got stuck, I'm not for sure. Me and zippers, and I thought maybe I could put in a elastic waistband, but that waistband is so small. Once you put in the pocket, well, the pockets are there, but once you close those pocket sections up, there's no way my waist can get into that. So I've got to figure out how to get that zipper and the waistband on. So, and I didn't see any videos. I know um, Rochelle did a video where she did these, but she didn't do the actual video. So that, I gotta figure it out because these are too cute to let them sit there. And I have like two, three, three boxes of uh, work in progress. That was W-O-P. Yeah, ridiculous. But that's what I did. I pulled out this one finished it and i'm going to pull out some more and finish as well but we'll see we'll see because i gotta gotta think see back on my head it's just it's it's running and running but anyhow i'm gonna get off of here because this is definitely shorter than the first one i'm gonna upload these and get them uploaded to the system
about that but this is the one that I said I ordered off of Facebook it's uh, wax prints that one I showed in the first video I had the same same fabric and then here's another this one oh, it's a six yard this one can go for fall that's nice I forgot all about these that's, that's the sad part yeah there's another one it's pretty if I'm not mistaken, Rochelle did her wide leg, her uh, culottes in that fabric. And then here's more of the same print. I knew, I said I didn't order duplicates, but these are from another company, but they're the same, but I have more. <laughs> so those were from wax prints. These two are from my favorite girl too on uh, Facebook, uh, Mo Cherie. Because the, you know, again, I love purple. And then I thought maybe I could use this for uh, Riley Frocktails, the Star Galaxy look. Because it had that vibe going on. Galaxy, kind of. And that gold is glittery popping type thing. I uh, don't know why I chose not to. I guess because the black was a star, the fabric, and I went ahead and cut that out. But I may could do something for that on Sunday. I don't know. And then I saw she had this as well. And she usually shows something, um, somebody in something. And the example she had for the lady that was wearing it was just so beautiful. I ordered six shorts. Yeah. I think that's six shorts. But those are from Moshe Sheree, those two. And that is completely all of my fabric. So with that, I'm going to sign out. Y'all have a wonderful, blessed day.